I just love sharing a cozy hot cup of Lapsang Sushong tea. Now, before we get into the actual video, does anyone remember these two dudes? So in case you vaguely remember or never even heard of them at all, Hoops and Yo-Yo were two mascots for Hallmark who appeared in a series of e-cards from the early 2000s to, as far as I can tell, the early or mid-2010s. The e-cards would range from birthdays and holidays to, oh, office work, to, <laughs> coffee, am I right? <laughs> They would mainly just feature Hoops, the pink cat, and Yo-Yo, the green bunny, just kinda joking around with either themselves, the viewer, or the current setting they're in. And wouldn't you know, these two characters were popular enough to get two TV specials. The first one was Hoops and Yo-Yo Ruined Christmas in 2011, and the second was Hoops and Yo-Yo's Haunted Halloween in 2012. And we'll be looking at the Halloween special today, so let's get right into that. Also, I want to mention that on the only upload I can find, there's this counter thing on the bottom of the screen, so please ignore that if you can. The special starts with Hoops, Yo-Yo, and a character I didn't mention named Piddles looking for Halloween costumes, the day of a party they're going to go to, and the day of Halloween itself. Now, the first thing I want to mention, aside from Hoops being the worst driver known to man, is the animation style. Compared to the e-cars, there's actual shading and lighting, and there's somewhat fluid movement with the characters. This is great and all, but I feel like at times the animation looks kind of stiff. It seems like it's only in the special for some reason. And at times, for me at least, it's really distracting, especially in scenes like this. Yeah, Halloween when regular people dress like the coolest scariest things, and regular houses get decorated and give out candy, and Chili Bear throws an awesome Halloween party where we dress up and wear first prize for best costume! Anyway, after more totally safe driving, they end up in a store called Get More, only to find no costumes. And yes, that even means no hobo costumes. I don't know why you need to know that. After that, they go to North Escapades Mall, which Yo-Yo doesn't want to go to because he is addicted to cinnamon buns. Cinnamon buns are just pastries! I know, but it's hard to love something and not have it love you back. <laughs> when I try to go inside, Yo-Yo's like, I can't do this, you guys. Then Hoops is like, do it for Halloween. And Yo-Yo's like, okay. Then they go inside to start looking around. They get distracted by massage chairs and they fall asleep in them. Then the mall closes somehow without anyone realizing that they're still customers and the characters get locked up in the mall. <laughs> After realizing everything is shut down, there's a montage of them doing wicky things in the building. Hey, look, CGI, everyone's favorite. Oh, shit, a ghost. Then, my god, there's more of them. The lights flicker, then... Hilarious. Then the rest of the movie seems to be just the characters running away from the ghosts. Should I even call it a movie if it's only, like, under 30 minutes? Oh, well. <laughs> After some running around, they decide, hey, let's just do what every horror movie does and split up. By split up, they basically mean Yo-Yo will intentionally troop up or something, and Hoops will go down to the basement looking for... Then Petals is like, hey, let's actually, like, be rational and defend ourselves or something. With umbrellas, of all things. Okay. <laughs> then it turns out the ghosts are actually costumes that were never bought in. Why weren't they bought in? Well, the cowboy isn't packing heat. Oh, don't don't shoot! Shoot! <laughs> That's just a finger, partners. The princess isn't a licensed character. In terms of marketing, I'm a princess without a country. And the ghost is just a sheet. As you might have noticed, my thread count, uh, not so high. Also, pretty much anybody with an old blanket and a pair of scissors can make me at home. And because the costumes can't leave unless somebody buys them, Petals pays for them, and... The damages. Damages? Ooh, nice segue. Oh boy! Yeah! Then they go to the party, and that's how the special ends. So what do I think of this movie? Well, for one, there wasn't a lot for me to say about it, which, now that I'm really thinking about it, what was even the point of this video? And I wish they did a little more, aside from just the characters running away from the ghosts. And I get it, these characters were only made for a series of V-cards, so what can they really do with them? Despite that, there were a few moments here and there that made me chuckle a little bit. between a clock and a yard place. And it's still somewhat of a fun special, which I wish I had a lot more to say about it. If you like these characters, then you might like this movie, so I'd say check it out. Even then, I'd say only watch it if you've already seen the Christmas special, which I'm hoping I'll have a lot more to say about for part two. Not much to say aside from just see you for, well, part two. Peace out.